this is how to design a keychain logo subscribe to this channel like this video and share and comment on this video let's get started first of all create the background we are using a rectangle a rectangular shape the radius should be adjusted give it something like 12 then color black it's okay like this take it to the back then you edit your test input the name you want to use now go to font i'm using i'm going to use few less girls for my home balance it and and make sure it is okay add the ring we are using circle opacity should be zero the stroke will be increased to 30 adjust and add it to the edge now you can now match the three items or layers together by taking the boxes to match it together so we have something like this now you can now remove the white test for it to be transparent erase color increase the tolerance to 70 first of all add a floor to it a black floor for the black space there as you can see now you merge it together now it is together then give it a texture we are using a golden texture the texture should be enabled then 100 should be increased to 205 this is okay like this now it is not finished you have to emboss and the background should be placed all those things should be there to make it realistic now the emboss enable it and start adding the uh, the effect now the light angle i'm using 225 for my light angle 125 it's okay like this my intensity will be 100 ambient light 100 specular hardness will be 85 85 85 and beaver should be 20 something let's use 28 28 okay now I'll bring in the background then we can add the shadow to see how it works so the background I'm using is a road background this one this one now it remains the keychain you have to download that one too now it is transparent now you can see but we have to merge it together so I will click here and click the buses then move it together merge it together now it is together but we need to make it realistic let's, let's add the shadow so the shadow blur radius to be 0 offset x to be 4 minus 4 offset y to be 3 so something like this 